Gobble, gobble. Oh, wait, no, that's No, it. that's a uh, <laughs> hoppity hop, motherfucker. Hoppity hop, motherfucker. Yes, you! You're fucking stupid! Hey! 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 Welcome to Stupid Movies, episode 159. Indeed. Where we watch them so you don't have to. And this week we picked a winner. Yeah, we yeah. watched Easter Casket. <laughs> From 2013. Mm. Not rated. 80 minutes. Directed, starring, produced, edited, written, written by Dustin Mills. Yep. You know it's always going to be quality when it's a multi-hyphenate director. <laughs> so starring a few people <coughs> uh, tied into previous episodes yeah. that we've done. So we got Jason Crow, who was in Volumes of Blood. And then we got Steve Rip. Rimpisi, I can't say it right. Rimpisi, I think. Yeah, Steve Rimpisi. It's Steve. In... We're sorry, we're butchering your name, but yeah. we're stupid. <laughs> it's on the title card. It is. We we <laughs> fair warned you. <laughs> uh, he did the voice of the carousel horse in Carousel. Yeah, and then a Ronnie Jonah, who was also in Volumes of Blood. Yeah. So, it was cool to see some familiar faces. So, what was this? Uh, <laughs> This Easter holiday theme movie about, my oh, friend. Okay. The Catholic Church is having a meeting to remove pagan symbolism from Easter. So the Easter bunny and Easter eggs and things like that. They want to take all of that out of Easter. All the silly stuff out of it. And the Easter bunny is actually an ancient god slash demon. They were never really clear. Yeah. And it makes him angry, so he starts killing people in Easter themed ways. <laughs> yes, indeed, he did. Also, the Mega Pope. Yeah. Also, gratuitous amounts of nudity. No holes barred at all. Did you say no holes? Yes. <laughs> like, yes? Yes. Wow. That's kind of obscene, Rob. <laughs> well, you, you know. But true. But true. <laughs> so what did we enjoy? I guess that's a perfect segue for what you loved about this movie. All right, so this movie had all the bees covered for me. Had boobs, had butts, had some bush, had a lot of blood, and it had bunnies. All within the first, like, minute. I like the WTF factor. The yes. What the hell is happening? Ah. Uh, 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 oh, uh, yeah. I mean, ah. Uh. Uh, the humor in this was awesome, though, just because it was so dumb, so stupid. And there's numerous times it laughed. In fact, one of my favorite scenes was with Jason Crow's character who played, I think he, it was a priest, right? Or father or something. And right. We, he had a black dildo, and then this other nun guy. That whole scene was ridiculous. Giant, it, veiny black dildo. And it, yeah, it cracked us up. Oh. Good. Uh, the movie did have some gore in it. Yeah. Um, but, mm, yeah. Meh. Uh, but I did like the gore. Yeah. There's some cool, a lot of. Uh, it was low budget gore. I yeah, mean, a lot you know, of CG we're, gore. We're not looking at really super high quality, but right. Some of the practical stuff was pretty good. There's a little bit of practical stuff that looked pretty good, like a, a throat got sliced up. Yeah, and chick pooped out Easter eggs. Chick pooped out Easter eggs. Pretty sure most of that was practical. Yeah, I really like the bunny. <laughs> it's a horrible puppet, first of all. Oh, it looks so bad, but it's and so then they great. took human teeth and put human teeth in the puppet's mouth. And it was... <laughs> the dialogue in this movie was ridiculous. Oh, my gosh. Ridiculous. I don't know how they managed to make it through some of those lines without laughing. I know. The pacing was really good. <laughs> it was. It, it seemed to fly by. But this movie, I mean, it was so bad it was good. It, oh. it definitely falls in that category. It is a terrible movie in a lot of regards. One of my other favorite scenes, there was a peep massacre. <laughs> Seriously, I mean, it went on for like five minutes. <laughs> Little yellow peeps flying around. I don't remember how they got there. Uh, the guy had a store and he was... The chick who pooped her brains out? Oh, and yeah. laid oh, all the eggs? They, they came, that's right. Yeah, they all came out of that. So, what did we dislike about this movie? The CGI in this movie could have done without it. It was bad. <laughs> Just well, as a whole. It looked like old PS1, PS2 era video game yeah. CGI. I don't, I don't know. The, the plot I could see as a dislike to a lot of people. Um, not really a dislike, like for me, but just it was really over the top. And I think a lot of people wouldn't dig that. 
Yeah. You know, so... If you are... How do I want to say this? You have to have somewhat of a sense of humor about religion. I was going to say, it could be... Yeah. It could be very, very offensive. Very offensive if you're... Uh, especially if you're, if you're Catholic. Catholic. <laughs> you know, or heavily religious. You, you probably wouldn't be watching something like this anyway. Well, you, you have an extended scene of a priest with a giant black cock and right. a nun. And, and they're banging and, yeah. and it falls out of his butthole. And... <laughs> but, you know, so we said the what factor... Uh, we, it's, it could be a dislike too because it happens. The whole movie is that way. There's really yeah. not, you know, the from shot to shot. It's like, what the hell's happening now? It went from this to peeps flying around to stuffed bunnies having sex to attacking people. Yeah, what's the, happening? The stuffed bunny orgy scene was <laughs> right. Did we mention that there's a bunny orgy scene in this movie? That's something to bear in mind too. I, I you know. Why it's very, it's a lot of fun. It could get old. Yeah, uh, it didn't for me personally. But the, the sound at some points was a little off. Mm -hmm. um, it sounded like they did voiceover that didn't work very well. Yeah, there were times where their mouths were moving and no sound was coming out. There was the one scene when the two girls were the two naked uh, girls were at the hotel. Oh yeah, and like the one was yeah, and then, and then the only sound that comes out is Bleh! and and then as much as we enjoyed the bunny, you know, um, the voice and the laugh got. Annoying. Fast. Yeah. Overall, man, I I will say this movie was entertaining. I definitely enjoyed it. Yeah. I, if you're looking for an Easter themed horror movie, this is the one. Go get it. Did we mention that a nun got killed by a carrot going through her skull? We did not. How did I forget that? Yeah. So, well, you want to rate this thing real quick? This movie did it for me. This is right up your alley. I had fun with it. It's <laughs> stupid. It's funny. It's gory. It's got questionable CGI. It's got questionable amounts of nudity. Very B at, movie. At multiple points, I was like, "Are we are we watching a porno? Are we watching a porno this week? Is that what we're doing?" Because well, you did pick it. I so. did pick it. I'll give it a six and a half out of eight. It was really, really good. I liked Solid. it a lot. Yeah, this movie is definitely for <coughs> a target audience. Uh, you got to be pretty. Hello, I am the target audience. <laughs> you pretty much have to be me. Yeah, exactly. Which there are a lot out there. And, you know, I enjoyed it too. Uh, not quite as much as you did. Um, were you going to say something? Well, I was. there's a lot of me out there. Well, probably. That's troublesome. <laughs> Call me, guys. We'll get together. We'll drink. You know, yeah. circle jerk. Watch horror movies. <laughs> we will not do this in my basement. <laughs> we'll do it at Rob's place. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I had a fun time with it. It's very silly. Over the top. Good time. Um, watching it by yourself may not be as much fun. No. Keep that in mind. I wouldn't so, have had nearly as much fun by myself. Yeah. Watch it with friends or whatever, but I had fun watching it. It, 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 it was something. Um, so I'm glad I did. Yeah. I'm going to give it a five and a half out of eight. So, you want to see Rob fuck his ass with the big veiny black dildo? I mean, he can use one of mine. On on uh, the subject of big veiny black dildos, we want to give our shout out this week. <laughs> we're, we, we have, so we're going to shout out uh, our buddy, the Carolina Creep on Instagram. That dude's awesome. And then... Uh, Trader underscore video. So we are at the end of season. Do we even have seasons? We don't even have seasons anymore, right? We we used to do twenty per season. Yeah, and we're, we're at uh, the next one's gonna be one sixty. Yep. So, so we're we're this is the very end of this season, and we're gonna start a new one. Uh, but we're gonna take a couple of weeks off. We've got some work we want to do. Things we're gonna update. Uh, yep. Clean up work that's needed to be done for a, a long time anyway. Yeah. Um, Things that we're going to do on YouTube so that they quit sending me copyright notices. <laughs> right. <'Cause laughs> the lawyer fees are getting really expensive, guys. <laughs> be uh, sure to... There's going to be some cool stuff coming up, so stay tuned. We're not disappearing. We're only going to be off for two weeks. Yeah, we'll still be posting. Stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, we'll, we'll still be around. It's just there's not going to be any new movies or new videos for a couple of weeks while we get things yeah. set up. What you can do for the next two weeks to help us out is tell everybody that you know to go to facebook.com slash stupid movies or to check us on Instagram at stupid movies uh, and help us build up this audience because there's some tools that YouTube has that we don't have access to right. until we have more yeah. viewers and more subscribers. You can also uh, email us at stupidmoviesatoutlook.com. Hi. <clears throat> and you can also <laughs> follow me at the horror punk. Yep. And at Dr. Chess Turner. Which... Yeah, I don't use it. Yeah, but hey. Rob is the head of our Instagram department. <laughs> I am the head of our Facebook department. <laughs> right. So check those out. Word of mouth. Let them know. Like, follow, subscribe, whatever that mm -hmm. stuff is. No, don't like and follow this. Until we see you again, our friends. Yeah, stay here in a few weeks. 
And we got some sweet movies lined up, so. Do we? Yeah. Well, I mean, kind of. Theoretically. Theoretically. <laughs> that we know of. I mean, so. Bye. <laughs>